What's going on guys? My name is Evelyn and today this is a tutorial video on how to make a profile picture for your YouTube account. I'll be doing many tutorials on how to make your YouTube life better you could rather say. And today this is just simply making a profile picture using Photoshop CS6 I believe this is. This version whatever it is. But anyway, so there's no many different backgrounds that you'll need to actually start making your profile picture like the radial background, the grunge background, here, the pattern background, gradient background, or just even a normal background, and many other things that you'd like to add on to it. Like you could add a little cartoon in the background or anything like that, maybe like Fallout Boy or something like that. But in today's video, whew, out of breath already. All, to, all I'm going to do is use the radial background here. So you can just stretch this to size or whatever, hold shift, or just do it normally depending on what you really want to do. I'm using the radial background anyway, this is like a nice blue one. Kind of doesn't really fit in central, but I guess that kind of has a little cool effect to it. So I'm just going to use in this purpose. I'm just going to use a layer A. Maybe for all year. I don't know. I don't know. But let's use this color. I'm thinking. And also, yeah, I'm going to add some guidelines as well. Doing this won't be cut because for some reason, when I add this to Movie Maker, it just goes really low quality, and it's quite weird. Because, yes, I edit with Movie Maker, don't judge me. <laughs> so, I think I might want to make it a bit darker. I'm using the Obelix font as well. If you want to look at that, Obelix, Obelix, whatever you want to call it, really. But I think that'll do as a, as a background now. So you've got these two little things, this is just a simple background. And now what you want to do is you want to add different things, different options. So what I'm going to do first off is add bevel and emboss to the little circle around it. And you just want to get size perfectly. Because as you can see, just having that right there makes it does stand out. You want to add stroke next, or that's what I'm personally doing. Oh, um, maybe two, not sure. Or just one. I'll do two, why not? Yellow. <laughs> and you want to get just a nice dark blue. You can do this for every color obviously. However, I'm just per personally just doing it like this. So there's many different things you can add on to it really and it really does just depend on what your personal preferences are. I can't edit this at all which is a shame because for some reason it just doesn't work. I'm doing this like a nice light bluey kind of theme. And that, that that's pretty much it for the profile picture. I'm just adding, obviously, a few extra effects onto it. Nothing too special, but certainly something that would make it look much better. Like that, you see? So I'll add some Satan into the mix. Some Mr. Satan town, everybody wanna frown, auntie. That, that should be a song. Like seriously man, if you guys want to see any more tutorials like this just for really just starting your YouTube yourself, then be sure to leave a like on this video. Just going this off of everything. I know I know quite a few tips about maybe just starting my own YouTube channel, but I guess this is all I can really do for a simple profile picture. If you want more to see more of an advanced one, can we get maybe ten likes on this video? And then I'll do an advanced profile picture tutorial, some banners, some stuff like that. And that's pretty much it. I recorded this with OBS if you want to check them out. I'm not sponsored by them or anything, but it's certainly a really good free software that you can use to record your gameplay on your computer.